Zing. Oh, you know what? <laughs> a thing we could do. I wonder if we can change their outfits from here. Yeah. So now he's he's got like more of a black and orangey look. That's cool. Yeah. All right. Jacob, I'm, I'm just showing it off because I have no idea if we're taking you on any more missions for like the rest of the game. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> right. <laughs> Good point. Just being honest here. Maybe maybe we'll get to come hang out during a random random side mish that's no you know, anomaly detected. <laughs> uh yep, fuel depot. May I yep. Jacob, feel free to tag along with me and Garrus on our next outing while we're discussing the logistics of <laughs> just make him really uncomfortable yeah really uncomfortable all right what are we up to gara says have you ever seen the shape of water <laughs> oh my god <laughs> uh what are we up to next right let's stay in that area is there what else is there to do over there we we cleared everything in that uh oh we did everything yep. over there oh, okay yep yep, yep. Oh. um then well g okay all right so what's so, left of our options right now so um jack's over here oh yeah you know let's do that let's help Samara's jack over there okay we'll go help jack yeah on the outskirts, kind of, let's like, mm -hmm. kind of, you know, yeah, rain things in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jack's way over there, so he's on the opposite end of the galaxy. <laughs> right. You know how okay. go. Um, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. I'll clear a few of these. Zernitra. Cold, distant Zernitra has extremely low density and is thought to be mainly water ice around the small rocky core. It has little to recommend it. Well, darn it. <laughs> it, it. It looks like dirty snow. Hmm. Kind of cool, but still dirty snow. Yeah, true. Alkanos. So Standard ice giant with methane ammonia atmosphere. Unusually strong magnetic field, which occasionally is useful when ships need to discharge their drive force. I, I want to lick this planet. <laughs> Blueberry. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't know. It just looks lickable. <laughs> I don't know if it would be blue. I don't know what flavor it would be. <laughs> the flavor is be. blue. I think the yeah, it, you know the, <laughs> the like, that, like that the flavor. Yeah, blue. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. The, the, is like, it called blue? I think. The, yeah. the like otter pops, like blue otter pops, yeah. taste like yeah. <laughs> right. It's just blue. It's the blue. blue. <laughs> um, Gamayun is a hydrogen helium gas giant with six large icy moons. The outermost one, Gigula, is of note for a well-preserved wreckage of an ancient starship that was recovered by a Turian military surveyor. Little information has been released to the public on the vessel, aside from a scholarly paper regarding how the internal layout suggests a horizontally oriented race. That's interesting. Like, maybe they were even quadrupedal or something? Like, maybe they were bug people? I don't know. Ah, oh, interesting. Gross. I walked around flying. I mean, that's fine. Okay, I don't mean to be racist towards bug people. <laughs> As we are in this game, where these weird kind of bug people are, are enemies. <laughs> right, right. It's like, you know, they're not always gross. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that sometimes, you know. Bannock! Well, I find bugs gross. And there's yeah, nothing I can yeah do sometimes they're gross. Sometimes they're really cool and sometimes they're really gross. That's just the way it yeah, is. sometimes they're real cool. They're often very cool, but I just want them to be in the photograph and not, and not with you. Me. Yeah, yeah. And that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Bannock is a large superterrestrial hothouse with crushing carbon dioxide atmosphere. Ugh. High average density of over seven grams per cubic centimeter indicates that Bannock is a mineralogical treasure trove. If only there was some way to safely reach its seas of molten metal and loads of radioactives. Whoa. The planet's mass is so great that trace amounts of helium and molecular hydrogen can be found in the atmosphere. Uh, interesting. We got a flow. Kind of cool looking. Yeah. Alright. Pra Pragia. Pragia. You take the jungle planet. Okay. 
Uh, the jungle planet Pragia is overrun by choking hypergrowth caused by industrial industrially mutated plant species. Whoops. This combined, yeah, whoops, <laughs> like you do. Um, this combined with its relative isolation and lack of population has made Pragia an occasional base of operations for drug runners, weapon smugglers, pirates, mercenaries, terrorists, and intelligent agents seeking secrecy. Sustained habitation on Pragia is extremely difficult, where mutant and even poisonous plant life can overgrow colonies in days instead of years. Whoa. Yeah. Yikes. Sounds pretty no thanks. Yep. Um, we can take anybody. Um, I sometimes take Miranda, but you can pretty much take anybody. It doesn't... She's not, like, close you know, with anybody. I feel like she and Kasumi have similar vibes, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, I think they could be, be chill, you know? Maybe, maybe. Would you like Kasumi in her red outfit? Yes. Alright. Um, yeah. You I just... love this shade of red. It's a nice shade. Yeah. And like the the shepherd's um outfits red as well. Mm -hmm. I really like that color. Yeah. One time many years ago, this had nothing to do with Mass Effect, but <laughs> um I when I was married, I wanted there was like this bag, this like designer bag that I wanted. It wasn't like super super designer. It was juicy couture, right? So it oh, was yeah. like, you know, not that it's... that's not like yeah, super it's, fancy. It's not bad. Not um, fancy. It's not like off brand, but it's not. Yeah. It's not like Louis Vuitton. No. Nope. Um, so, yeah, there's this bag I wanted, and it was like that color, and it was so pretty, and I wanted it so bad. And then my husband at the time was like, sure, I'll get it for you. And I was like, oh, wow, he's the best. And then it arrived, and mm -hmm. it was pink. <laughs> and I was like, what? And he was like, oh, this, well, I'll, uh, you know, I'll take a photo and then tell the, the shop that they made a mistake or whatever. No, he didn't buy me the brand. He want, he bought me like a Chinese oh off God. brand. And the knockoff just happened to not be red. It happened to be pink. It was pink. That's... Um, <laughs> <laughs> it was like, and at the time I was like, I was so open-minded and kind to right. people, you know. Um, so I, I just forgave him as, oh, well, he tried, you know. Right, right. You fucking hunt, you bought me an off-brand bag? <laughs> it wasn't even the right color. That's kind of hilarious. I'm not gonna lie. Right, but... I how much I hate this place. Fits his... Yeah, it's a phony ass personality. Has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah, they build their equipment to last. Assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. We we got this girl. Get a hold yeah. of yourself. It'll be okay. I'm fine. Okay, let's get on the ground. I imagine this rain to be like warm, humid rain. Ugh, that's kind of gross. Yeah. <laughs> it's like when it's cold, it's fresh, but yeah. you know, like feels fresh. Yeah. But warm, it just feels kind of muggy. Yeah, exactly. That's what I, I feel like it must. With all this plant life. Get in there and plant the bomb in my yeah. I want to watch this place burn. That's fair. That's why we're here. We're gonna blow it up for you, Jack. <laughs> I never saw this room. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They were messed up and starving, but alive. Usually. This is unbelievable. Yeah, this is this is gonna be a dank one, girl. <laughs> <laughs> we're dealing with someone who was this experimented on as a child. Brutal. Like, look at that rain. That's well, a muggy um, rain. Uh, 
Glad oh, we're gosh. inside. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely know that feeling. Like, you, you know, we... I and I know you do, too, because mm -hmm. we experienced it in Japan, for mm -hmm. sure. That kind of rain sometimes. Yeah, yeah it's pretty gross. Where? You can you give this to me? And... Nope, it just went away. Okay, there it is. <laughs> Oh boy, we sold our money. <laughs> nice, okay. There we go. I can't, so with the plants growing in inside, I can't help but think of fucking Resident Evil 1. Oh yeah, for sure. The fucking plant. What was it called? I forget. The elusive man requested operation logs. Um, He's getting suspicious. No, well, I don't remember. Results, he won't care what we did. He won't find out. The elusive man requested hmm. operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. Sounds like this facility turned its back on Cerberus. He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, like this. This makes me think of Ugh. the fucking yeah. Resident Evil plant. I remember escaping to this room, fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. Plant 42 or something, something like, like that? Something like that, yeah. What, is that it? Something like that. I can't remember. That sounds about right. 42, 47, I don't remember. Yeah. Oh well, yeah, is 42 just a Douglas Adams thing? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm a big fan. <laughs> Uh-oh. I used to be when I was in high school. Wait, I didn't call him out, so I don't remember. Top ear. Okay. It immediately left my brain. <laughs> oh, like... I just googled Resident Evil Plant, uh -huh. and the first search that came up was Monster Plant, and in parentheses it says Monster Pronto. <laughs> I was like, is that the official name of in the first one? In the first one, yeah. Planet Forty Two is is correct. Is correct. Yes. Cool. I heard her. No, I how it. Oh, crazy. puppies! Bad puppies! There's a bear in here. They're already gone. Jeez. Okay, I think y'all are <sighs> popping out a little too quickly. Old blood stain. This looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here, pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood anything that happened here. How often did they do this? I was in a cell my whole life. Sometimes they took me out and made me fight. Filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did other children die in these fights? I was a kid, filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. Narcotics flooded my veins when I attacked. So they conditioned you. They actually rewarded you right. for attacking. I still get warm feelings during a fight. What the hell was wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. Let's keep moving. Hell yes. Excuse me. It's pretty fucked up. A little bit. A little bit fucked up. You know, just a little. Just, just, just a hair. I like the broken window. That is a nice touch. Yeah, that's cool. Excuse me. Oh. Ooh. Skylight. <laughs> Unintentional skylight. Hello. Yeah, Excuse yeah. Me. Security console. Security officer Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the. That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Well, maybe there's more to it. You were a kid. Things might have happened yeah. that you didn't see. The other kids attacked me, the guards attacked me, the automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. 
That was a weird spin around I just did. All right, <laughs> let's go, Lisa. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that Baron? It's a fresh kill. Good question. Here, wall, top. Syringe. Uh, there we go. I did it. What's in this room? Yeah. All right, let's go. What you guys doing here? There's a Krogan! There we go, get rid of the pyros, they're dangerous. Ow. Oh my gosh, I made the Krogan fly! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> nice customer. Whoa. Let's see here. Who's left? Get out of here. Why they need a morgue? This was a small facility. I'm saying these tables are the perfect size for little kids. Dissecting children. Oh, God. Bullshit. I had the worst of it, and I made it out alive. I don't know. It's starting to seem like you weren't the only one who had it rough. Right. Oh, that's the door we came in. <laughs> no looping. Anybody drop any ammo? Yes, no, maybe so. I'm gonna take that as a no. Okay, I'll put them. I'll put put those on them. Let's get some cryo on there. Bypass this door. Well, save first. Be safe. Then bypass this door. Syringe, um, wall, top. Ear. There we go. Let us in. So strange to be back here. I feel like I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch, but then I'm a little girl again. Shit. It's complicated. Let's just go plant that bomb. <laughs> it's okay, Jack. You can, we can talk. We can talk about it later. Don't worry about it. Gosh, having Jack on the team and all the extra shockwaves going around, I'm like, that one's not mine! Lisa <laughs> didn't do that one. Oh. Right. Bowling for Varen. Did I do that? I mean, maybe. <laughs> Anything in these cells? These cells look- They kept kids here. Look at the cute little bunk beds! <laughs> oh, let's have a sleepover! It'll be fun! Oh my god. Yes. It's a two-way mirror. My cell is on the other side. I could see all the other kids Oh no, here. they're stuck. I screamed at them for hours, and they always ignored me. Yeah, you didn't know. Okay. 
Jack popped out? Because Kasumi hasn't popped out yet. Here, here. Kas oh, oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, so this. This is the two way. Yeah. Yeah, they couldn't see you, girl. They didn't know. Couldn't see or hear you. And either way, that sounds horrible. I must have come through here when I broke out. But I don't remember it. This is a bad place. Yeah, this looks like a bad place. Yeah. Had some consoles. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects, but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll Whoops. not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. Sounds like they were, girl. So... Yeah. This whole place was built to turn you into what you are. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. Well, find some kind of strength in it, girl. You move on. Harder and tougher. Not sure why that counts as Renegade, but... Yeah. Sure. Uh, purple. I had to purple. Okay. I need... Green. I need the blue stairs. There we go. That one was easier. This might be useful. Heck yeah. Of course we'd find something for biotic damage here. May I have these? Thank you. It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. We're shutting Kelton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully that will give... Zero, wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. I mean, you were a kid. You were also distracted. <laughs> yeah, for sure. There was a lot going on. I was dumb. I keep my eyes open now, and I always shoot first. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Hello, gentlemen. Hey, Arash. It's Kira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put him down. Then I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. What the fuck? <laughs> what are you doing here? First we're gonna kill you. Then we'll see. Kill them on my order. I'm not dead. Come here. Oh my god. Uh, can I get Woo! Wow, that pyro is still kicking. Concentrate fire. All squad. Form up now. Making sure nobody's coming up from the side oh, there. Oh, hi. Whoa. The fuck? Stun locked. Come here. We outnumber and outgun all. Can I have yeah, okay. Boom. All right, let's see. Oh, you sold your barriers. Um, you don't really have anything for barriers here, so I'll put my barrier up. Lisa, go. Fire. 
That was hilarious looking. My shields are down. Well, not for long. Whoa, we went in the wall. Thank you, Kasumi. Oh my god, that was amazing. He tried to charge her, but her shadow strike was over. Oh, that was good. Bye. Nice. God, that's gotta be. left is my old cell. Whoever Arresh is, he's in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. You know, it's fun to watch the the, the effects, but also kind of terrifying to think of like ammunition that basically freezes you and then lets them just shatter you into a million pieces. I'm just saying. Yeah, that's pretty. It's kind of scary. Oh, there it is. I wish to bypass. Wall, syringe, ear, top, wall, uh, top, ear, syringe, there we go. Give us all your- why is there money here? <laughs> why? Oh, what a lovely- what a lovely little, little, little kitchen you have here. <laughs> How nice. I love what you've done, uh. <laughs> Look what you done with the place. Come out. We know you're here. Who are you? My name is Oresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Yep. I... Yep. Drawn here, like you, I'd Looks say. Like you're not the only one pulled back here, Jack. I tried to forget this, but a place like this, it doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew, how to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. Um. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? What the fuck? You do the same thing to new kids. Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. No. There's no reason good enough. Are you nuts? You lived it. This place was like a prison. How'd you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. But then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something. No, no, it doesn't have to. Sometimes horrible things just happen. Yeah. We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that. Ouch. Girl. It's not gonna matter to, to kill this dude. Like, it's not gonna change yeah. anything. Jack, yeah. he's trapped in his past. You need to move on from yours. He wants to restart this place. He needs to die. He's crazy and he's never gonna restart this facility. You have to let it go. Your past doesn't have to control you. Fuck! Get out of here. Go! He's not worth chasing. None of it is. You did the right thing, Jack. Maybe. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. No time. <laughs> of uh, course. Go ahead. Of Nothing's course. Changed. No time would be so different. mean. Let's uh, we're, we let's check out the two-way mirror from this side. 
I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. Never did any good. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. Yep. Yep, I would too. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. You were a kid. Right? Jeez. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Okay. No more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Let's go. Wait till we're a little more clear. Yeah, right. But no, we need to have a, we gotta have the dramatic explosion. Oh boy. Uh oh. I'll deal with it. Take pictures. <laughs> Touch me and I will smear the world with you, bitch! Enough. Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me was wrong. It wasn't Cerberus. Not really. But clearly you were a mistake. Screw you! Whoa. You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. So if you can't do one of these? Like, if you can't pick a blue or a red? Uh huh. You have to pick a side in this argument. Oh, that sucks. And guess what happens? You lose the loyalty of the person that you didn't <gasps> pick. Oh no. It, I believe it's. I think there. It is theoretically possible to get it back through some conversation, but you have to. You have to have enough. Um, you not only have to have enough Paragon or Renegade, but you also. I think at least in the old vanilla version, there had to be a like. If you had a lot of Paragon, but you still had, quote-unquote, too much Renegade, sometimes, okay. like, it, you wouldn't get the option. Like, the balance, if the balance was off by the games. It was weird. And in the old vanilla of this, if you weren't carrying in... Because I, I was in this situation. If you weren't carrying in a Mass Effect 1 character or reusing a previous character you took through Mass Effect 2... You would not have any bonuses. It was impossible. Wow. To keep loyalty. Oh, geez. It was That's really brutal. bad. I think, yeah, I think, um, yeah, my first time through, I, I sided with Jack on this and I lost Miranda's loyalty. Um, yeah. It's, yeah, uh, it's not I think good. If I was, if I had to choose, I would probably do that too. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Our mission wow. is too important to let personal feelings get in the way. Fuck your feelings. I just want her dead. You both know what we're up against. Save your anger for the Collectors. I can put aside my differences. Until the mission's over. Sure. I'll do my part. I'd hate to see her die before I get a chance to fillet her myself. You two gonna be okay? It's a good thing you came by when you did. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. Yeah, okay. So, Miranda, no bad. Don't say things like that. Commander, what can I do you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another okay, time. I think we're out we'll of Miranda work. conversations of until... Of course, Commander. Maybe just before we do endgame stuff. Um, Where am I going? I'm circling, I'm circling. Garrus will still have the same thing to say. <laughs> Right. They'll be all like, yes, I'm, I'm down. <laughs> hey. People are talking out there. And I hear it all. I can see why Jack is the way she is. I don't like it, but I get it. Yeah. Good thing you broke up that catfight between Jack and Miranda. 
I was afraid they'd tear a hole in the hole. I usually travel All hidden right. away in cargo bays. It's nice to be able to look out a window for a change. Uh -huh. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk. Later. All right. I'd I'm like gonna to presume that everyone that we've I go. acquired I loyalty for, we have generally exhausted dialogue. Ah! I've been we've been playing Silent Hill too, and I keep pressing the button to <laughs> arrange the put the <laughs> camera behind my head. <laughs> Oops. Um. Well, let's see if Zaid has any fun stories related to to Jack and. Then we'll uh, we'll go talk to her. Hey, Granddad, how we doing? This mission takes me back. I knew this girl once, Asari. Good head on my shoulders. We had this whole thing going. Yeah, I remember this one. She sold me out to the blood pack. Put a sour note on the relationship. Yeah, a little bit. Didn't do that. All right. Hey, Jack. We're coming to hang out with you and your Sith Lord lighting. <laughs> It going. I needed to wipe that place off the map. You took me there to do it, and I owe you. You don't know what it's like, Shepard, to have garbage like that following you. It marks you in ways you you don't expect. I I can't stand that your choices in this are get over it or yeah I do know. Like where's yeah. my where's my? Of course I couldn't possibly know, but I'm glad we did it. Right. I've made a lot of hard choices, Jack. Like what to let go. Hard to walk away from it. You'd think it would get easier now that the place is a crater. But what else do I know? Did it help to not kill the guy? I never thought I'd see you show mercy, but you let Aresh live. He was trapped in the past, reliving it every day. You showed how that could be me. I'm not getting stuck like that. I'm better than him, and I'm sure as hell not carrying that crater around with me. Do you think you're different now? I know that place is gone. But I still kind of want to kill every person I see. No offense. <laughs> I mean, it's a start. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take what I can get with you, Jack. You did a lot, Shepard. Shit. I'm not good at this soft stuff. Just... Thanks. Okay. Let's let's get back to work. Wait, what does that mean for you, Jack? Like, what does that mean? What is getting back to work for you? <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> Oh, we can go, uh, hey, Joker. Hey, Joker. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Thank you, Kelly. I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? Let's go see if Joker got anything for us. Hi, hi, you, you never given us your line about Jack before, so let's, let's hear it. Hey, Commander. Glad we figured out Jack is crazy, because I was really up in the air, just hanging there. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about the people we're picking up? Well, about the ones you went out with last... I'm not saying anything about Jack. I'm not stupid. <laughs> I like Kasumi, but why do I feel like I need to check the Citadel for parts she may have pawned? It's just my opinion, though. There's really no need to go spreading it around. Uh, how are things here? I assume everything's going well up here? Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made my point. That's it for now. See you, Commander. All right. See you around, Joker. <laughs> oh. I'm... I'm sorry, because it's Seth Green, like, every time I see Joker, I'm like, hang on to those apes, man. <laughs> hang on to them. Don't lose them. Oh, they're already gone. Thank you. From Leslie. I am Leslie. I was on Aya. The food made me sick. The doctors are helping me now. One doctor knows Jacob. He says he can tell you this. He could write this for me, but I want to do it. I need to use my words. My words are coming back. I can talk well. Reading is hard, but I am getting better. I have to get better. Taylor wanted me like this. He wanted my words gone. I have to show him that he lost. I am not weak. He did things to me, and he can't now. He can't take away my words. He can't make me not me anymore. 
because you and Jacob stopped him. Thank you, Leslie. Yay, the neural decay can at least be partially reversed. That's good. Open that map. Relax, place is just explore. There's more systems in this cluster. Let's go check them out. Hmm. Klapsha. Oh. Anybody hiding in here? No? Okay. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> With over 90% of its surface covered in oceans, Yum is a habitable nitrogen oxygen world, but its extremes can be quite hostile to sapient life. The heat from its extremely long days reaches dangerous levels ranging from 24 Celsius at night to 53 in the afternoon in the temperate zones. Hurricanes run unchecked across the oceans with winds reaching up to 250 kilometers per hour. While there are some arthropod-like animals, the predominant forms of life are various kinds of toxic algae blooms that stretch hundreds of kilometers across. <laughs> However, other uh, biohydrogen carbon algae blooms are suitable for use as biofuel, and farming the green gold forms the backbone of Yom's economy. There's like almost half a million people living there. Capital wow. New Karnak. Launching probe. In research projects, Element Zero is used for bioamp and omni tool upgrades, which allow squad members who have e biotic and tech powers to be much more Edie? effective. Edie, I'm sure we've collected Ezo before. Have That's we not? <laughs> Have we not somehow? Tefnut! I remember Tefnut! <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it's home to Helium 3 Collection and the nearest refueling facility to the Nubian Expanse's mass relay. As such, it's a major gateway to the Burge and Terminus systems and has become famous for its hospitality industry. Tefnut... <laughs> Tefnut's motto is throughout the is known throughout the galaxy. Like home, only better. Oh, wow. Visitors here can stay at expansive resort stations, watch locally produced entertainment, buy mind-affecting substances not welcome in Citadel space, and rent companionship. Ooh. Resources are shipped in from Yom at substantial discounts, allowing the small space stations to have a surpri have surprising luxuries such as edible arthropods and large <laughs> amounts of fresh water. Oh you know, God. space drugs and hookers. That That's basically it. Weird. It has nothing else it kind of going sounds on. Sounds like a vibe. I'm kind of down. Who wants to go to Tefnut? <laughs> <laughs> like home it's only down better. To, it's down to go to Tefnut. A par party at Tefnut. <laughs> I was trying to <laughs> figure out how to make a D's nuts joke. Yeah, and I was I couldn't too. Do it. I, Teflon I D's do nuts. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, something like that. That's, that's pretty good. Uh, you got nothing on Tefnut, Naressa. Naressa is an unremarkable methane ammonia ice giant with oh, a bar. small family of icy moons. It's likely that the Cretaci system had additional worlds earlier in its history, but uh, these have been swallowed by the aging star. Cretaci is an elderly metal poor population to star, broadly similar to Arcturus. Oh, dang. Probe away. Yep, that was it. Everything else has been eaten by this. Wow, look at that. Delicious. Brady. What are we hitting up next? Okay. Oh, Samara? We, we can help Samara? Yes, we can. We can also recapture yeah. that Frida while we're at it. Cool. Let's see, it's probably one of the neighboring. Or is it is it here or is it one of the neighboring? Oh, there it is. Arin Larkin! You were holding out on us. You had a secret mission all along. <laughs> we came here, didn't we? Yeah. Because it only had Utha. 
recapture that freighter. Derelict ship detected. Registered MSV Strontium Mule. Visibly damaged from weapons fire. Ship is not responding to hails despite life signs aboard. Transmissions using known Blue Sun's encryption detected. Airlocks are sealed, but the ship can be boarded through an emergency hatch in the cargo hold. <laughs> hmm. All right, who are we taking? Oh wait, wait, wait. That means you have a new outfit. This is her. So this is her oh, spare yeah. outfit, and then this is her, her, like, her, her other outfit for being loyal. Oh, it's cool. Okay. Interesting. Okay. A little less naked, and you know, Slightly sometimes a little less naked is kind of not the worst thing ever. You know, yeah. sometimes it's you know. kind of okay. You know, survive. Um. All right. Do, do. Let's take, let's see, uh, Thane and, uh, Zaid. <laughs> I know we were taking Granddad <laughs> out. We gotta walk <laughs> Granddad. <laughs> he is eight but out in six squad <laughs> points. <laughs> What does the Inferno Grenade even do? Yeah, that's kind of good. We'll, um... We'll, we'll give you a little better Disruptor Ammo, but we'll hang on for the Frag Grenades, yeah? Yeah. Um, we'll probably retrain our powers at some point, but... For now, we'll just put it into Incendiary. We are almost maxed out. I just noticed. <laughs> Alright, you got your Viper, and yep. Yep. Um, how about you guys take different, uh, you take the Matic, and you take the Incisor, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Blue Suns are like, uh oh Yeah, uh, yeah. Whoa. -oh. Sure. Come here! Nah, never mind. Let's see here. I want you. I want cryo. Can't reach the target. Wow, thanks, Aid. Mm. Appreciate it. I feel like whenever the, the boys with the concussive like scream, they're like, I'm firing an impact shot! You're kind of sitting there like, I presume this means for everyone to duck. Uh, right. Merc data pad thing. Dax, that incoming ship isn't leaving. Looks like the fools are moving to board. Airlocks are sealed, so don't waste your time. Get a team together and be ready to welcome them to our cargo hold. Blow them out the cargo bay doors when you're done, Captain Forrest. All right. Whoa! <laughs> Why did you guys not come through the door? What happened? What happened? They were just—they were like waiting for us to read. They're like, "It's—it's it's rude dinner up. It's rude dinner up." <laughs> All airlock sealed, can't do anything about it. Let's go up these stairs. I wonder if anyone is still here. Can't get a lock! Well, that's because he's already dead. Oh, 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 he's doing wow. <laughs> Dramatic. <laughs> More Merc transmitters. Jakir, you seen the stash they pulled from the cargo? We get that open and we're living the high life for months. Sergeant Bortus, Bortus, took the canister topside while Voris went to pry the codes from the ship's captain. Man, wouldn't want to be that guy. Hawkins. Yeah. Alright, let's get these doors open. There must be a way in. It's, it's memory. Okay, we have to play memory. I know that that would be easy for you. I should probably just let you do this thing. 
but my ego says I have to do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a... I don't to do it. Yeah, I agree, Zayden. Oh, I guess we're going this way. Med station. Ugh. Ugh. Bad thing happened here. Yeah. It's over here. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, that one that's locked. Uh, let's um, let's go check this out. Mm, 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 mm. Was that? Was that? Is that that thing? No. I saw a thing. Maybe maybe it's for below. I don't know. Where's your buddy? Oh, he's what over there. The hell happened here? Bad, bad happened here. <laughs> Very bad. Oh, look at these. Look at these. They look like they're from Mass Effect 1. Oh. <laughs> Oh, let's see. Let's go back down this way. Should be another thing over here. Oop. Maintenance records. FTL drive damaged and repaired with substandard parts. Risk of complete failure is elevated. Ooh. That's also not great. Oop. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hello? Who? Who is- What? Hello? She's just on the floor. Hello? Nope. Can't do it. I'm gonna shockwave you to death, sir. <laughs> there you go. Hold still. <laughs> what a way to go! That is the way to go. Did we get them all, good boys? Did you get it? Let's go this <laughs> way. Wow, you just walked right through that. Nice iframes. Uh. Um, can we get- can I get a warp from you? Okay. See some power cells. Oh, didn't need any. Engine room controls. FTL drive and operative. Ooh, more transmitters. Kurtz! Heads up, man. Those intruders are still alive and fighting their way through the ship. They have Commander Shepard with them! You better get your men ready to fight. Bortus has something up his sleeve. He's got that canister full of loot, and I think he's planning to do something to Boris and take it for himself. Wouldn't be surprised. Beather. Meow. <laughs> Who? Who is grabbing cover? Who? Where? Oh my god. 
Where are you guys? Yeah, that was the a field drive thing. <laughs> Just these things slinking up. I guess they're up here somewhere. <laughs> Don't know where Zaid went. Security lockdown. See console. Well, I haven't seen one. Hang on. Where's the console then? Where is it? Did I miss one? I must have. Must have missed a security console somewhere. Like out here. Like I thought we did this. Yeah, it's done. Hello? What? I'm so confused. Hi guys! Welcome to- what did I not- what switch did I not hit? Where- where did I miss the switch? Time to go back through all the zones. Cause this- these- all these just told us- It's fucking broke, dude! And then there's PDAs on the floor. It drives me bonkers, I can't jump over that! Go this way. We there's also like nothing. Let's just restart the mission. I feel like something's oh. broken. Right, bummer. 